Hi guys, Jimmy with Jimmy's Auto and Firearms, and I've got some uh, J. Scott gun grips. Now these are vintage grips. J. Scott has uh, been out of business for a pretty good while now, but if you look on uh, some of the, you find them at gun shows. I found these on uh, eBay, and I thought they were just spectacular looking now. It's a J. Scott, part number was 33, and they are uh, laminated white pearl grips. So I've taken one, each side and I've mounted one of them on the left side of a black. Both of these firearms are government model 38 Supers. So I want y'all's help. I want y'all to tell me which firearm you think they look better on. The one on the left is a uh, blued, which is now a, a basically a black color, but it's the Colt blue. Now, one thing I really liked about these grips is that they have a little laminated area of wood color on them before you get to the pearl white. Now, these are not real mother of pearl. Those have become so expensive that, gosh, uh, uh, no one can hardly afford those anymore. Uh, at least not me, I can't. So, But I thought I'd put one on a black gun or a blued gun and one on a stainless gun. I didn't even, let me grab a rag here a minute. I didn't even wipe this gun down. So let's uh, get a little of the oil off of it. Get that out of sight. But again, what I found was interesting on these grips, most of the imitation pearl grips you see nowadays, they're pearl all the way down, but I just really like these that have that wood laminate underneath the uh, white mother of pearl. So I thought... I'd let y'all help me decide which gun was going to get these grips. So, just a one-word comment, or you can add more, your, your feelings of why, but let me know whether you like them better on the uh, blued gun or the stainless gun. I just really like the grips. And while I've got y'all in this video, I was at a gun show this weekend in Texas, and I found some 38 Super. There you have a look at the end label on the box. I had never seen this ammo before. Colt National Match 38 Super Plus P. They're 124 grain. They're conventional uh, full metal jacket. They're not uh, hollow points. But I just was kind of intrigued by... It's made by a company called Double Tap. And I did go to their website to look, and they do make a variety of calibers that are all Colt, apparently Colt-approved uh, ammunition. So I thought y'all might enjoy seeing that. I picked up a box just to have and uh, got it at a gun show down in, where was that? Somewhere in South Texas. Yeah, it might have been Gonzales. Uh, I don't think it was Gonzales. It was, uh, Bastrop. It was down in Bastrop, Texas. So, anyway, there you. Uh, this will be a short video, but help me out, guys. Put a one word or more comment below and uh, help me decide which of these two guns is going to get these J. Scott vintage grips. So, there's a look at the box. Even says 38 Super on the box is one of the ones that fits, but these are... Obviously, full-size 1911 type grips. And uh, as I was cruising through eBay, I did notice that the number 33, some of them were uh, white, some of them were black uh, that were on there. But I just really like these, uh, these white pearl grips. So, hey, give me a like, give me a thumbs up, uh, subscribe to the channel. I'm always trying to bring you all stuff that you don't see every day. So, hey, I appreciate you watching. And until next time, guys. We'll see you down the road.